welcome back again to another video if this is your first time here you are absolutely welcome to natural growth secrets don't forget to hit that subscribe button and you are welcome to the family and to all my returning family thank you so much for coming back to watch our amazing hair growth videos so today's video i'm going to be making a creamy moisturizing hair butter with shea butter and infused with a whole lot of amazing herbs that will promote hair growth and treat dandruff hair breakage alopecia baldness if your hair is super super dry you are going to benefit from this hair creamy moisturizing butter guys so first of all we are going to be infusing our amazing herbs first of all i added one um tablespoon of clove to my uh, to my cup and then i'm going to be adding one fenugreek tablespoon of that and then we are going to be also making use of black seed like black seed is so amazing to promote hair growth and stop dandruff and also stop uh, boldness and uh, alopecia if you are experiencing itchiness on your scalp if you want to grow your hair out like with this three seeds like these three amazing herbs you will be able to grow your hair tremendously all right family so right now i went ahead to blend my amazing hair growth herbs or seeds whatever you want to call it so after i blended the seeds i would then go ahead to add in my oil blending your seed will allow the oil to be properly infused okay blending it will allow all the nutrients to go into the oil so i'm going to be making use of coconut oil you can make use of any other oil such as almond oil castle oil avocado oil crepe seed oil there are so many amazing type of uh, um oil so just add in oil that you know that is beneficial for your hair so as you guys can see my oil is infusing the abs is already infusing into the oil like these seeds are so great as you guys can see the oil has darkened up because of the black seed so you want to put your stove or your gas whatever you're using to cook in a low heat let it infuse and after infusing for about five to ten minutes go ahead to off the stove and then let it cool down before straining it okay that is how you infuse this oil and this oil can be used in so many ways you can go ahead to strain your oils or your you can go ahead to strain the oil and use it on your scalp for hair growth so moving on to the other stage we are going to be making our okra juice because we are going to be adding this juice to the butter okay just to make it creamy and more moisturizing to the hair so i am going to be going ahead to uh, prep my okra i will go ahead to wash it give it a rinse and then slice it and prep it for the juice so you guys will see what i am about to do it is very simple juice to cool down before straining it this okra juice can be used as well in so many ways it is super moisturizing to the hair it promotes hair growth and stop dryness and breakage it is super super moisturizing guys i'm going to be using part of the okra juice as a leave-in moisturizer later so guys this okra juice is super super great for hair and it also allow your hair to reduce off dryness and breakage like i said earlier so our oil is also cooled down already and our shea butter is ready as well and my shea butter is very very soft it has been in a room temperature so there's no need for me to melt it down so i'm going to strain my oil as well go ahead to strain the oil properly before adding it to your butter so after straining it this is what it looks like guys so i'll go ahead to um to beat it up or whisk it up like so before adding in any other ingredients okay 
okay guys so this is very very super amazing for hair growth as you guys can see this is looking creamy already all right family so if you have found this video helpful at this stage why not subscribe it is absolutely free subscribe to the channel like this video and also leave a comment down below in the comment section guys of what you think and right now i will go ahead to add in my sweet almond oil at this stage go ahead to add in whatever you want to add it whatever you want to add into the butter such as uh, your essential oil your vitamin e oil or if you have any preservative that you want to use to preserve the butter go ahead to add it to it at this stage right now our butter is ready you can go ahead to pack it up and store it into your container and use it and again this stage is optional guys this stage is optional i want to add in my okra juice about two tablespoons of my okra juice i added it to it to make it more creamy and moisturizing and at this stage guys you can add it your you can add in your okra if you want okay all right family so apart from using okra juice you can also make use of aloe vera juice as well because not everyone loves okra okay so if you don't have okra available you can use aloe vera or if you don't love okra on your hair you can use aloe vera aloe vera is very very great i love aloe vera i swear okra is just like aloe vera and okra is more cheaper than aloe vera so if you love um okra go ahead to add in okra if you love aloe vera go ahead to add in aloe vera juice or aloe vera gel go ahead to add in two tablespoon of that if you want to make it creamy then if you don't want to add in any juice it is optional if you don't want to add in any juice just go ahead to package your hair butter like so and use it as a moisturizer and also a sealant which is very very great as well okay guys so yeah that is what i want to say and after adding in my okra as you guys can see this has become very very uh, super creamy and very very light as well <laughs> Alright family, so some of you might ask how do you store this creamy butter? You can go ahead to store this in the fridge. I normally store uh, this type of hair butter, hair moisturizer, leave-in conditioners in the fridge which is so super great and it is it is going to preserve it and make it last long for you so this will last for up to a month or even more than a month depending on the amount that you make for this amount that i make it is going to last up to a month because normally i love using moisturizer on my hair because my hair is super super dry all the time i have fussy thick hair and my hair is thick as well if you have a thick full hair you will understand what uh, what i mean because you will use a large amount on your hair in order for you for it to combat the dryness okay so if you have dry hair it can lead to breakage and more damage so you have to make sure to moisturize your hair so that it will prevent it from drying all the time and this hair butter will also help to detangle your strands you can use it when you when you want to make your protective hairstyle like this is super super moisturizing the okra is very very rich in antioxidant zinc and iron it contains a very special plants that help to hydrate dry hair and damage hair as well so the clove the the fenugreek and the black seed that we use in infusing the oil is super amazing as well to prevent some conditions that might be preventing our scalp from growing um growing at and also it prevents uh, alopecia dryness uh, boldness and also it helps to make our hair uh, super super soft okay guys so this butter can be used in so many ways and on my next video i'm going to be showing you guys how i properly moisturize my hair and prep my hair for protective hairstyle and also how i um how i grow my hair at using protective styling and also i'm going to be giving you some tips on why um, natural hair 
might not your natural hair might not be growing and how to grow it at so stay tuned for my next video so go ahead to subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you will not miss out on the video so i'm going to be showing you guys a little clip on how i am going to use the butter but on my next video i'm going to be showing you properly on how i use the butter and also how i moisturize my hair properly and prep it for super hair growth so guys go ahead to store your hair creamy moisturizing butter in any container of your choice as you guys can see this as this is so moisturizing like this has a lot of benefits for your hair and this is what it looks like after storing it on the fridge i'm going to show you guys what it looks like it is going to solidify the more and it is going to be creamy i swear so right now this is what it looks like after a day or two about two days this is what it looks like i just brought it out from the fridge now to use it to moisturize my hair and this is what it is looking like it is still intact it did it did not separate it's at intact. all and yeah this was properly missed missed <laughs> this was properly missed guys so yeah and right now i'm going to show you guys just a little of how i use the butter and what it looks like on my hair thank you so much for watching this video and if you have watched this video to this extent you are the best thank you so much and don't forget to stay tuned i don't know if the video is up by now but if it is up i'm going to be leaving it in the link in the description box how i prep my hair for super hair good guys i dropped a lot of gems on that video so you want to miss you don't want to miss it guys so stay tuned and thank you all so much for watching and i will catch you guys on my next video bye for now and stay blessed